What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix COD Black Ops 6 is having stuck on Odin screen message of the day error which is happening for many users right now and how we can fix this app. So let me directly get into a step. So the first one, you have to go over here on your Steam. So many users when they're trying to play the Call of Duty Black Ops 6 they end up in having the issue. So before proceeding to the step, we have to know one thing first. So this is happening for many users after a new update which is rolled out and this is actually from the developer end. So even though we have some steps that can be tried, so the first and famous step is all about. We just need to go over here, search for the task manager and you have to click on the task manager. Now from here, if you find the COD is running, if you find the COD is running, right click on the COD and go for end the task and you have to remove it. That is what you have to try as the first step. Now afterwards, still if you are having the trouble with the message stuck on the loading screen message of the day, even though if it's popping up, you have to just wait, maybe three to four minutes, just wait it and you have to check whether the game is launching or not because for some users as for, as for the Reddit, even after waiting for three to four minutes, it launched for them. So you can just wait for three to four minutes and you have to check. If that is not working, we have to move to the next one. That is all about where you just need to press, you have to launch the game, then keep on pressing escape key from a keyboard and once the error message load up, just go for retry. You have to keep on pressing escape button from the keyboard. Then once the error message is loading up, you have to go for retry and you have to check. Similarly, if the escape button is not working, you just need to launch the game. Then after the error message is popping up, you need to press space bar and F1 all together. You have to press both all together. You have to keep on pressing it unless the game is successfully launching. This can also be done. And the last and the least step is all about after trying these minute step, if it's not, it's still, it's not working, just go over here, navigate to the documents. Now from here, we have to get into the folder, my games. Now from here, you'll be having the folder for Call of Duty. So right click and go for delete it. Once you delete it, you have to close this and go back to the game and check. And this time the issue will be completely fixed. So these are the steps and I hope this video is helpful. That's it. Bye bye.